Okay, we made a sale. This is the Tetley Teapot backboard key rings and the hooks uh, with one of the towels. So it's in here nicely, protected. And that's going to get wrapped in some cardboard and then put in a bubble envelope and posted. Which should protect the any edges from any damage in post. I also sold the power lead. Not wrapped that up yet. Wrapped that up in a second. That was a fiver plus um, postage for a TV. No, no, I don't add that to this. But I just want to show oh, how, you know, bits and bobs still sell from broken TVs and stuff as well. So... Anyway, this will bring our total up soon. We'll work that out shortly. Um, but it was £12 plus delivery. And I got £5 plus delivery for the thing. eBay just paid me today about £19 I got back for the both items. The delivery, obviously, what's that? Say £6, £5.50, £5.80, £5.80 USA off £19. <laughs> <laughs> so that's there you go that's that's the rest is commission and delivery so i think that leaves me with about 13 quid in the bank for that for them two items so there you go okay so it's uh getting late evening had a busy day but these sold today and the message uh the buyer has just messaged me saying they're pretty desperate for them and they need them right away so we're going to get them posted ASAP, uh, quarter past nine. I think I can post these as long as I do it before 10 o'clock. Should be okay. Right. So I think stuff sank in the shoes. I'm going to put them into this bag and then put them in a box and they'll be all nice and clean and protected. Okay, let's go on it. Typical, they won't fit in the bag. Uh, bubble wrapped nicely though, so that'll do. Okay guys, so, here's the first thing. King Kong Film Cell. 436460. There are two for sale on eBay. One's been opened. And it's priced at about £6, I think it was. It's been opened. And the other one's from overseas. And to buy that in this country, it's £27 plus £11 odd delivery plus VAT. It's ridiculous price. So King Kong Film Cell. It's the one where he's on top of the tower hitting a plane. Them lines underneath for the back. Uh, and that cost me three pound. Okay, so this is something that's not going to sell fast, that's for sure. And I only brought this one because I brought these two. Okay, so here's the first one Return of the Jedi. This one cost me five, as you can see there. So I haven't looked up how much this one is yet. So nice though. I wonder what that scene is. Oh, I see it. So it's okay. We'll look at it later. I doubt it's that, right? Could it be? I don't know. And then, anyway, anyway, that's that one. That's that one. Star Wars. Now they have been sitting there. For a good couple of weeks, because I see him before I went on holiday, and I was like, "Should I get it?" I was like, "I need my money for my holiday," so I didn't bother buying it. And this one cost me eight, so I think it was eleven pound in total. Eight, not eleven plus, no. £16 in total for free and they're collectible uh, it's not something I would buy myself normally I'm just I just bought them for the resellers channel so it's coming out of the resellers money 
So let's look at how much Return of the Jedi is and the Empire Strikes Back. Well, I don't know if it's good or bad, but this one's not there. There are similar ones. And a starting price of about six ninety nine, depending on what it is, I suppose, up to 150 quid. So what would I get for that? I don't know. Right, let's look for the next one. Okay, this one's a bit more promising. Someone has decided to put bids on theirs, and it's currently at £8.50. And uh, well, they pay £8, okay. And then the very next price for one is 30 the next price is 40 and next price is in the hundreds. Um, they're like COA, they've all got the COA on the back of these ones. Really like to see that picture, whatever it is. Oh well. Uh, limited edition, so not bad. They would um, price accordingly, of course. I think the best thing to do is to see them pictures somehow. On the Star Wars ones, anyway, not on the King Kong one. I'm just going to try and double my money on the King Kong one. Um, but yeah, right, so there we go. Not a bad little thing, eh? I mean, they were sitting in that in that glass cabinet for absolutely weeks. And I was just waiting. <laughs> I know it's terrible, but what can I do? All right, so that was the, uh, the buys for the channel and for the reselling. And we're going to see how that goes. I was really pleased to get them. And I just got that one because it was in there. I was like, sod it. I'll get that and all. So, yeah.